this is any better. Okay, so thank you guys for bearing with me. Um, I don't know who's back on yet. I just restarted. Um, I turned off my internet. I ended the live and started over. So when you all pop on, if you can, huh? It should be good. So when you guys all pop on, if you could let me know what's going on, what you see or not see. Um, I'm really frustrated with this. <laughs> hi guys, hi guys. So, is this any better? Is it any better, please? <clears throat> Hopefully it's better. Ah, oh, Vera said much better. Perfect. So we finally are in business. Everybody's is good. Hopefully. Awesome. I think that helped him because everybody says it's good. Okay. So now let's get back to business. So I went over rules. I'm pretty sure you guys heard me with the rules of the game. But um, if you didn't, please let me know. Um, like I said, about every four to five, maybe six pieces, I'll answer, ask a question. That's one drawing. Then I'll say like, share, and for being here drawing is the other one. So there's two separate drawings you can be in by the end of the night. The game one, you do not have to be present. No, you have to be present to win. No, which one? Game one, you don't have to be. The other one, you do. <laughs> oh, which one? I lost. I lost track. Hold oh. on. So for the game, they don't have to be present. And for the other one? What's the other one? The, the one like share, whatever. Don't they have to be present at the end to win? Yeah. Okay, so. Sorry, guys. I It's been a long day, but I'm getting myself together here. <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, Ampic. Okay, so for the game, you do not have to be present to win. For the end, um, for the like, share, and for being here, if you win, you do have to be present. Otherwise, I pick another person. So, with that being said, I am on piece three. So, let's go from there. I've got two tags on here. So, here is number three. It is a bracelet. It's a bracelet. This is a gorgeous silver cuff. Hold on here. Let me get these out your way. So it's a silver cuff with a purple and gray stone. It's a glassy gray and purple stone. Very, very nice. And look, I even went jewelry free today just so I could let you guys see what's going on. Well, almost jewelry free. Okay, work with me here. Grout it. And that one is stuck on my wrist. That is number three. So if you like this bracelet, you can comment number three. Um, why do I always have so many problems hanging this? <laughs> I might be telling you to do it. <laughs> okay, next one. Sorry about that, guys. Okay. So next I have a um urban bracelet which is silver it's actually gorgeous very lightweight very lightweight <clears throat> silver um more of a men's or or just a it is more of a men's bracelet i think um it is from our urban collection so um it's just a silver chain bracelet i actually have a necklace that matches this she said, oh no, you've gone blurry again. Um, I just... So, if you like this chain bracelet, comment 69. Is it still blurry? I don't know why we're having so many problems today. I never had this problem on my lives, ever. Since Father's Day is right around the corner, I have quite a few urban pieces in here. It's better again. Looks good to me. Okay, perfect. Good. Um, here is the next... What was going on right here with this wind? No, I need it right here. Thank you. Okay, so 
um, off-road tourist it is a uh, an adjustable slide knot it is leather there you go leather with the silver rings perfect thanks lens threaded along this it's got uh, the, the, the I guess it's more of a tan so it's more of a, a cream color tannish color that's threaded the opposite way on the dark this is what it looks like again it is the slide string and then you just pull to make it close this one here is number 65 like I said I do have quite a few urban since it being Father's Day okay then I have a ring this is one of my interesting rings I have quite a few people that like this ring but um, this one is called Emperor blue you can see that it's actually super pretty that blue actually matches my shirt beautiful beautiful that blue gem is beautiful so let me give you a, a here this is what it looks like it is almost a knuckle ring because it does go from here to here um, also stretch band thicker stretch band you can make it bigger or smaller um, by taking out some of the um, links um, it normally fits size 6 to 10 very comfortably so if you like that one then comment number 47 I didn't realize that one matched my shirt I've been looking for something to match my shirt all night <laughs> okay after this one we'll read a card and we will get moving okay another ring Britannical beam is what this one is it's a silver ring with purple three purple little stones got filigree beautiful pattern looks like so again it is a knuckle ring it has the thicker back so we have some that are skinny and some that are thicker. They're very comfortable. This one is 91. And let's do a question. Who's ready to answer questions? My hair's a hot mess, sorry guys. Okay, question number one. Name something that might ruin a romantic dinner. <clears throat> The first one that he sees that answers the right question <clears throat> will get put into our game drawing. Here's our game box, baby. So, okay. Hello, Amy. How are you, love? Long time, long time. You went to high school to get, well, middle school, high school. You Hope you're doing well, love. Okay, so while we're waiting for somebody to get the right really lens. <laughs> um, so while we're waiting for somebody to pick an answer, you want me to read that again? What was it? Name, hold on. Name something that might ruin a romantic dinner. I need the number one answer. Pretty funny though, lens. I gotta say, that would be kind of okay. So, while we're waiting for people to guess and hopefully get it, um, the... <laughs> I think that's close. What is that? What does it say? No, that's these are people I know, that but are joining. did you see Michelle said hi, Jen? Yep. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Aaron. Hi, guys. Mm -hmm. Nice to see you all. Okay, so Michelle, you're absolutely right. It actually says, what does the actual card say? 17. So 17 people said an X. <laughs> so, okay, that's question one. Michelle, yeah, she goes in this one. 
All right. Good Lord, Michelle. All right. So, Malibu Sunset, number 57. Silver earrings with the faceted mint green teardrop beads. They're so pretty. I love this mint green. Um, that has the sterling silver frame. It's got dainty white rhinestones. Can you see them right there? All right, so number 57. And once I get to the end of my board over here, I will go back again like I was. Sorry. Card. Oh, why? <laughs> oh, okay. Um, anyway, um, I will go back over the board uh, for those of you who have popped on later, um, just so everybody knows. Um, okay, number 15. We have the bright red stone. Hold on, this one doesn't want to sit right so we can see it. Bright red stone pressed into the center of a silver studded filigree pattern frame. They are teardrop. They are very lightweight. They go about right there. They are very, very pretty. Those are number 15. Patricia Brola. 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 Oh, my aunt. Hey, Nanny. Hi, Aunt Pat. How are you guys? Hope y'all are good. Hope y'all are good. Anybody who likes and shares my video will be put in for the drawing. We are also playing Family Feud today. So, um, my sister just got the first answer correct, and after I show about three to six pieces of jewelry, or four to six pieces of jewelry, I'll do another question. So, here is the next piece. I'm trying to think. These are pink and silver. They have the solitaire white rhinestones, if you can see them. The little flower pattern in there. Little chains. Super light, super light. Let me get my pink hair out the way. They will sit about right here. Again, they are fish hook, lightweight, pink and silver. Those are number 58. Thank you guys all for joining. I appreciate you guys. Hope everybody had a happy Monday. And again, with Father's Day coming, I've thrown in quite a few of my urban collection um, for Father's Day. Um, so here is the next one. It is a nautical bracelet. It's all leather, kind of woven. A little bit of a rugged look. It's really nice. Um, it is the drawstring again, so you just pull the string like so, and it closes off. Lucky it's my day off. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> this is number 70, so if you like this one, comment 70. One, two, three. I'm trying to keep track of how many I'm showing so I don't forget to stop. Okay, I know about what the heck. Here, it just makes it more fun, so. Okay, forget it. Let's just do another question. Ready? Hi, Shalita. So, she's in there because she was here. Um, name a professional team, a sports team, named after a bird. The top answer is what I'm looking for. Name a professional sports team named after a bird. Hi, Melissa. How are ya? Melissa wasn't here, so she does not have one in the, her name is not in there. Melissa? Yeah, Melissa Simpkins. Hope you're doing good, miss. Okay, so while we're waiting on, to, really, Michelle? Who, look and see who was the first one. Michelle answered already. Michelle's the only first one that Michelle answered first. Yeah. And then yeah. So the first the the top answer 
is Eagles. <laughs> and the second one was Cardinals. <laughs> Sorry, Vera. You're good. All right, Michelle, that's two for you already. Everybody needs to pick up their game because Michelle's going to win again. <laughs> All right. Next piece. <laughs> All right. So, Elite Shine. You got the dangly chain earrings. A little bit longer necklace with the lime green teardrop gem with the dangly chains at the bottom. So you've got your little tassel, lime green, beautiful, beautiful color. And just plain chain. Very simple. All right, that's 55. <laughs> oh, my sister. Always on it. <laughs> okay, next, the Urban Sprawl. These are beautiful bangles. They are silver. They look like so. They look like this. It's one whole set. So you have some, don't oopsie, you're fine. I'm just giving <laughs> you a hard time. So this one looks like this with the little flat edges all the way around. And then you have the second one in is just, has like the little, what do you call those? Um, what is this called? What? This right here, serrated, is that what it's called? I think so. Serrated, I think is what it is. So anyway, they all are like that. So like every other one, no, every two are different. But, so let's see if I can put these on my wrist for y'all. Maybe. They're bunched together, so they're kind of hard. So, this is what it looks like. Very, very pretty. Beautiful silver bracelets. This one is number 94. So, come at 94. All right. Hold on. I'm about to do one more, and then I'm going to call another. <laughs> I'm going to give you another question. Um, if you guys are coming in late, please just say hi so I know that you're here and I recognize the fact that you came. Next one is a gorgeous orange necklace. So here we are with the long chain and this gorgeous orange pendant with the beaded, you see it beaded around that teardrop. Or studded, yeah, studded is probably the better word. With a beautiful orange pendant. Again, it is it is a little longer. You can see that. That one is 74. All right, let's see if I can do another one and somebody else can get one. Okay, <laughs> name something with teeth. Name something with teeth, and I need the number one answer. <laughs> All right. Huh? Say it again. Name something with teeth. Like teeth? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> okay, next one. Silver ring. Just overlapping bands, basically. It's very basic, very nice, casual. Again, it is a thick band. Lisa? Huh? Lisa Aker? Is she here? Oh. Oh, yeah, she is here. Hi, Lisa. I didn't even know. I didn't see her come in. Hi. Sorry. Anyway, again, just basic, very, very casual silver band. This one is 116. Oh my god. Lisa got it. Huh? Lisa got it. I see mine's not moving now. Oh, that would be why I didn't see her. Hello, Lisa. What is that? I don't know, but I had to move my stuff all the way up. And Lisa, you are right. So you go into the into the family feud box drawing. So at the end of the game, or at the end of the live, we will pick somebody. Heather. Oh, hey Heather! Yeah, it's Giselle's daughter. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay, next ring. Beautiful, beautiful. Born to rule. 
Born to roll. Various cuts and shimmery the glitter of the hematite rhinestone. Gorgeous band. It does have a thin, thin band. Thin band. Hematite. Huh? Hello, April. No. Um, if you like this one, comment number two. Okay. Vera shared the video. Oh, thank you, Vera. Okay, guys. So I'm going to run back through the, the ones that I've done already just so you guys have them. Hello, April. Let's do it. Oh, let's, let's put you up here where you can see me. Okay. Huh? For share. share. Yes, this one is game. Okay, here was number one. Well, I'm sorry, number 75, but the first one. So they're orange and silver. Thank you, April. Orange and silver, lightweight, very thin. They would go about right here, I would say. Number 75. Clear, I guess it's like a clearish bead. Mm -hmm. Very, very nice. I think my sister bought this last time. Have you got this yet, Michelle? It's gorgeous. It really is very pretty. So this is what it looks like. Hey, girl. It would bow. It's not very long at all. Again, this is number 144. Next, three is a cuff, silver cuff with it's gray it's like a grayish hold on let me get this out of your guys's way here so it's a purple stone mixed in with a light glassy gray oh good i'm so glad you love it 144 that's amanda here awesome uh, I'm glad you like it, Michelle. I like it. It's it's beautiful. Um, so this one again. I'm sorry. Was three. Um, three. Next one is number sixty nine, and this was a urban men's bracelet. Just basic silver chain. Number sixty nine. Another man's urban. I mean, you can probably technically, I mean, females can wear this. It's very, it's very cute, but it is in our more male line. So it will look like, like this. That one is 65. Then we have number 47. That beautiful bright blue gem with your solitaire circle diamonds all the way around it with a wide band. <laughs> hey, Brewer. How are ya? Number 47. Hi, Lisa. Thanks for joining, hon. Here's number uh, 91. It is a knuckle to knuckle silver with four purple solitaire stones in the center with filigree. Beautiful. That one's 91. Then we have 57, which are Malibu Sunset. Malibu Sunset. Fish hook, very light. They look like so. Those are 57. Number 15, which is from top to bottom. Um, they do have the filigree throughout. They have the bright red, if I can get them to hold still, sorry guys. The bright red stones. And then the dainty, dainty little crystal-like stones around it. Those are number 15. 15 people watching. 
Oh my goodness, that's awesome. Um, 58 is the silver with pink. Little flower in the center with a, a clear stone. Fish hook, very light. I almost blended with my hair. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, those are 58. And then we've got this one. 70, which is another urban leather. Very, very awesome looking. As soon as I get through going through these, we're going to do another question. Number 55. Longer necklace with the lime green, lime green gem there with a little tassel at the bottom. Number 55. And then we have our bangles, silver bangles. This is all one set. Um, those of you who don't know anything about paparazzi, everything is $5 and it's also nickel and lead free just so you guys know. And then you just pay tax and shipping and handling per however many items. That's 94. 74 is another longer necklace with an orange pendant on the bottom. That's 74. 116. Very casual ring, silver, thick back, 116. And oh, number two, it's called Born to Rule with a hematite <clears throat> stone. You've got um, clear, the crystal, nice pretty clear crystals with a thin band, very thin band. That one is number two. Who? Daniel. Dana. Dana. That's my cousin. Hi, Miss Dana. How are you, beautiful? Okay. Yeah, that's my. Well, no, she wasn't here before. She just got here. So, hi, beautiful. Thanks for watching. Okay. So, that was what we've gone through so far. If you have any questions or you want to re see one of them, describe it. Let me know. Right now, we're going to do another question. We are playing Family Feud. Everyone who is playing um, gets one answer per person. I need the top question or the top answer. And that is a separate drawing than being here and sharing my lives. So the next question would be name something presents. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. Name something parents hope their son has done by the time he's 30. Hi, Miss Becky. Name something parents hope their son has done by the time he's 30. Miss Lisa, 144. That's right here. Oh. 144 was sold, Lisa. What did it look like? Hey, from Georgia. Hi, beautiful. I need a thing. Amanda. <laughs> I think Amanda was it. Wait, why are yep. you giving me this? You want to say what it looked like? Oh. If this is what you were talking about, Lisa, this one was sold. That was 144. Is there another one? Here, babe. Amanda's correct. What? Amanda's correct. Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh, I think Pedro already told everybody. <laughs> Amanda was correct. No. Nope. If you ask me and it has to do with my son, I'm talking about moving out before he's 30. <laughs> Just saying. Because the kid thinks he's staying with me forever. That one was simil silver similar. Um, I have two necklaces I've shown other than that one, Lisa. And it was this one. And it was this one. I haven't shown any other necklaces yet. I'm working on that here in a few minutes. Okay. Number 92 is called At Any Cost. Right? Yeah. So we have the black. Oh, not a problem, baby. 
Um, what did Amanda say? I can't keep up with that right this second. Hold on. So this one has a clasp with the extra length. It is black with little, oh, hold on, I'm trying to get it to there. So it almost looks like a little, that is number 92. Amanda said that hers is 25, he's moved out and moved back in three times. Oh, well, <laughs> I have one of those too, Amanda. The so number 92 would go semi-well with number 93. Oh, honey, <laughs> I'm not trying to worry about that right now. <laughs> yeah, Amanda, I have one of those two who is 24 and has been home three times. So I understand. Um, Pedro is typing in the answers um, as we go once somebody um, answers correctly. Okay? All right, number 36. This is, hold on here. Yeah, it does look like Mickey Mouse. <laughs> this one is called Colorful Cabret. It's got the filigree with the white rhinestones. Thank you, Heather. Heather shared. Okay. With the little white beads at the end. Very, very cute. There, they sit about right here. Very lightweight. Very lightweight. And these are number 36. Is Sue here? No. Hi, Miss Sue. No, I, because I don't even see her come in. Okay, so. Okay, here is another necklace, finally. Okay, so it is an orange. Whoa, hold on. Trying to get it all undone here. It's actually really cute. Hi, hey, Susie. How you doing, beautiful? So you have the little dinky earrings. And it comes down into this V shape, kind of, with, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me put it on here because I can't get it to hold still. <laughs> there. Okay. Let's try this one. This is better. So it comes down like this and my chains are still intertwined. I don't know what's going on here. I think it's there. I knew it was something like that. Okay. So you've got it. Oh, they're still intertwined. Forget about it. All right. Anyway, so this is what it looks like. You've got your chain with the orange. It's like an orangish brown color pearl, to be quite honest. So, yes, you can, baby girl, anytime. You can also call me and do a private order. I love you. All right, that one is 72. 72. All right, who's ready for another question? Are we ready? I'm gonna do this one last piece right here and then we're gonna do another question. Okay, next one, Southern Expression. There are the yellow studded silver accents, floral stamped discs, they are fish hook, and they hang about there. Southern Expression, number 61. Southern Expression. Okay, next. Who's ready? Who is ready? Name a country older than the United States. Name a country older than the United States. Go. Huh? You said. Oh, my Giselle's on. <laughs> okay. Giselle, you've missed a few. Like 20. So I'll try to go back in a little bit. Okay. <laughs> so here is the next one. It is a pink. Um, it is a, a dainty silver with a pink crystal like bead that's placed along in the center. I see you beautiful. With, I uh, just said hi, Pedro. <laughs> 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 um, with the, 
I totally lost my train of thought. Okay, pink stone in the center with the white um, crystal-like stones. Amanda got it. Amanda, Amanda Wind. Again. Yay! Again. <laughs> Thick band, number sixty. Good job. Woohoo! Between you, and Michelle, you guys are killing it. All right. All right, so the next one I have is a necklace, and I also have a matching bracelet for it. But the first one is number 95. It is, hold on here, I'm trying to stick it up there for you. It's pretty cute. Pretty cute, pretty cute. I like it, actually. Um, I think I actually have this one. So, yeah, your earrings, you guys know your earrings. This is what the necklace looks like. Lisa, I think you have this one, actually. I think Lisa bought this one at one point. Um, it's got the copper and the silver. You see that? And then, hold on here. Let me grab the bracelets so you guys can see them together because they're pretty awesome. It's a really cute set. Oh, what's this one? 95? Okay, so this one's 96. So here is your bracelet that matches. There's your bracelet, and here's your necklace. So 95 for the necklace, 96 for the bracelet. And 96, and 95, there. All right, and we have a brass necklace. Brass. Just have 96. Just 96. You don't want the matching set, Giselle? Seriously? <laughs> there you go, babe. Okay. Here's your brass necklace. Oh, hold on here. I've got a, a random piece that's hanging somewhere. Okay. There we go. With your brass pendant. If you can see that. And then you've got your tassels at the bottom which are intertwined again there there you go brass it's actually a really cute necklace that one's number 12 number 12 and okay <laughs> jennifer huh jennifer norman 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 Oh, hello, Jennifer. Okay, next one. Oh, Jennifer Marks, Norman. Yeah, that's Norman. Jen. That's my girlfriend from high school. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> Thank you, babe. <laughs> Paige was trying to say this person, this person. I'm like, I don't know who you're saying. Hmm. Okay, so here is your next one. It's a beautiful light blue. Light blue with um, the silver. The the. the Blue is um, pressed into that silver center in a teardrop, each one of them. Um, smaller, bigger size, they're all different sizes. Very, very pretty. Light blue. Do you like that one? Number 81. Um, and now, Here is the next one. Oh, I probably should use the black one for this. Um, so, all right. Next <clears throat> one. Paradise Goddess. It's got the white crackle with the beaded frame, the real little beads, and then they go to bigger beads around the ending. But it's crackle stone. What's it called? P R A I S E Goddess. And here are the earrings that go with it. That one is 122. I've got all these things standing in my face. What's wrong? What are you doing? 
Don't be acting crazy over there. <laughs> He's trying to be funny with my, typing for me. <laughs> Only the bold me. <laughs> You're stupid. <laughs> All right, number 106. Enchanted vines. They are brass with some filigree in them. Very, very pretty. Very lightweight. They are uh, fish hook. And they look like so. Hold on, let's see. There we go. Very pretty. That's 106. Miss Baker? I miss you, lady. She was my hairdresser in Florida. She was the best. Oh, that's Holly. That's Holly, oh, Miss okay. Baker. <laughs> okay. I'm so excited for you and your new salon. Congratulations, girl. Wish I was there so I could come back. No. <laughs> you know if I come back there, I'm going to come see you anyway. So I'm just saying. <laughs> I miss you too, beautiful. All right, next one is number 80. And it's some bold yellow, ladies. Bold yellow. How many of you like bold yellow? I do, obviously. Mm -hmm. So, here's our yellow. Babe, that light is killing my color. Nope. So, turn it or move it or something. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Here. Do something with it. Because it's killing my color. I don't know. Hold on. All right. Thank you, Holly. No, no. get that <laughs> off my cup. He's killing me with this light. All right, is that better? Can you see? Can you see? Oh, Lord, it just went dark. All right. Can you see the yellow? There, there's the yellow real quick before he turns the light back on us. Anyway, okay, here, it's better back here. I can see the yellow back here. So that one is number 80, if you like that one. Okay, so I'm halfway through my board line again. So I'm gonna run through these real quickly for you guys, for those of you who have jumped on late. All right, ready? All right, Giselle, be ready. <laughs> Hold on, I don't wanna have to lean my stuff forward. Okay, these are orange and silver earrings. They are very lightweight. They will, they will show about right here. Number 75. Here is a cuff with purple and gray. So it's kind of like a creamy gray with some purple intertwined in there. It's really, really pretty. Hi, Miss Kelly. I miss you, lady. Number three, that's not gonna hold. Okay, for the men out there, for Father's Day, we've got some urban stuff. So here is a silver bracelet. Silver bracelet. Number 69, oh, I'm in here. Um, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> rude. <laughs> okay, the next urban is leather brown dark brown leather with the cream color and then you've got the silver pieces in the middle they're all intertwined it is a pole closure very nice very nice this is number 65 number 47 Karen Williams hey lady that's Miss Karen from Kentucky here's that bright royal blue with the gorgeous crystal like um, solitaires number 47 here is another knuckle ring number 91 and it is silver hello miss ashley that's heather's daughter um all silver with filigree and three purple if you see the purple in the center there's three purple stones that run down the center with the thick back adjustable for sizes six to ten that was number 91 number 57 is called malibu sunset green it's got the little white diamonds throughout you can see them at the top and around the bottom part and then the 
the lime green color beads. They are fish hook and they sit about right there. Those are 57. Number 15, red beads pressed into the center of this silver teardrop frame with filigree and you can see the, the studding inside of it. Those are also fish hook. Hi Ashley. They will be about this long. Number 15. Number 58. Some pink and silver with some little flowers in the center or a little flower in each center with the pink little beads. 58. Here is another urban for our men. All leather. Dark brown leather. It is also the pole. Hold on here. Ta -da. Hold on, hold on. I can't pull it by myself here. Huh? Oh, Miss Birdie. Miss Birdie. So pull string to make it bigger and smaller. Hello, Mama. All right. So number fifty-five. She was like my mama in Indiana when I lived there. My girl Pat. That's Pat's mom. Mm. There's the lime green crystal and a solitaire cut with tassels, number 55. Some gorgeous silver bangles. Bangles, bangles, bangles. It's a whole set. That one is number 94. Silver necklace with a beaded center uh, orange um, bead pressed in the center of the studded teardrop shape. Um, number 116 is a silver ring. Thick back. Sizes 6 through 10. That is number 116. Then we've got this hematite, hematite and clear paywell with the small back. Beautiful, beautiful hematite stone. That one again is number two. Then we've got number 92, clasp and they look like, they do look like Mickey Mouse, Amanda. You are so right. They look like Mickey Mouse on the edge of each one of those black. There you go. That one is 92. Number 36. The filigree with your white beads. Susie. Susie. Bernardi. Huh? Bernardi. My Bernardi girl. Hey, Susie. Next one, 72. Oh, hold on. This is the one that's tricky on us. Hold on. Okay. So this one comes down like so. There. There we go. With the orange. That's 72. Then we've got 61. That was the yellow and silver yellow and silver earrings look like so super cute super cute good lord then we've got this pink um this pink pressed bead in the center of that silver setting with the white rhinestones oh she's talking about 92. this one amanda yes the next one is this one. This is 95. And Jacil already bought the bracelet. But I do have more. I have like three of each one. So um, can I see Jacil's bracelet real fast just so I can I don't have to dig through trying to find another. So this is what the match looks like. Amanda, you wanted um, 92 then, babe? 
This is the matching bracelet that goes to uh, 95. So if you want the set, just say um, 95 set. If you want them individually, it's 95 for the necklace and 96 for the bracelet. Here, babe. Amanda, just let me know and I'll put it in your stuff, baby. Okay. Then we've got um, four more. And then we're going to do another question. Then we have the blue. Hold on here. Little teardrops into the blue. This one's backward. They don't ever go the way I want them to, just so you guys know. But it is blue. It actually sits really pretty when it sits. So, is my one turned around yet? No. There. Is that better? So it would look like so. Let you know at the end. All right, perfect, baby. 92. All right, so that one, the blue one is 81. Then we have the white crackle. Looks like this. You can. That one is 122. Then we've got the brass. Filigree earrings, very lightweight fish hook. They will sit about right there. 106. And then the bold yellow. Love this piece, but I'm like that. I'm bold and bright. So this one is number 80. Okay, so I'm all caught up. If there's anything you guys seen that you like, you want, you um, have more questions about, throw a holler up there so we know. And I'm going to do a question real quick, and then I will move on. Next question, ladies and gentlemen. Um, name a question a father might ask his daughter's new boyfriend. Name a question... A father might ask his daughter's new boyfriend. Here you go, babe. All right. Who's got this one? This next piece that I'm going to show you is brass as well. Um, I think I'm going to put it on the white one. So, looks like this. You see the the detail in there. It's studded, like glittery, uh, glistening glass. The plate just kind of glistens when you move it around. It's actually really pretty. And then it's got teardrop beads at the bottom. All right, this one is number one hundred. Got it. Good job, Mama. All right, next one, Risky Ritz. So, paparazzi calls this brown. What? Oh. What? No, I paused on my side. So, paparazzi calls this brown, but I think it's more of like a yellowish color. So, these little circle, they're circle earrings. They've got the yellow, goldish color um, stones on either side. They're fish hook. And they would hang about right here. These are 114. 114. Paparazzi Brown. What the hell? The people. Okay, next one. These are pink and silver stretchy bracelets. My grandbaby loves these, I'm just going to say. Every time she comes over, she's in my bracelets, especially the stretchy ones. So they do have, I don't, babe, um, hold on, there. So if you can see the pink beads right here, and then you've got the silver, and it's like that all the way around the bracelet. So there's three set, three sides to it. They have the, the pink beads in the center, and then two or three beads on either side. They are stretchy. They're actually really comfortable. Hold on here. Let's see if I can get these to wear right. 
pink stretchies. Hi, Miss L. How are you, beautiful? That's number 59. You like those? Comment 59. Here's some more stretchies. I do have a few of these. Not, not a whole bunch, but these are even... I, I would say these are for like a teenager. Grandkids. I don't know. Um, so this one has their blue. And one of them has a heart on it. One of them has thin beads. One of them has bigger beads. And on this side, it's got a little dangly heart. And then it says love in the center. Um, and that's pretty much what they say. They're really, really cute though. They're very stretchy, very, very, oh, here. Yeah, see, these are more for like a teenager, I think because they're tied on me a little bit. So that's what they look like. That's number 49. 49. So for anybody who hasn't been on, we're doing Family Feud. Anybody who answers question number, or the, the top question, um, gets put in for a drawing for the game. Anybody who comes on, gets one entry for being here, one entry for sharing if you share, and what's the other one? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, you'll get another entry for something else, I'm sure. <laughs> so, here's a brass bracelet with, again, the yellowish color stones. And it is on both sides, the yellow stones. Start off small, big, and then go back to small. Um, it is riveted on the side right here and also on this side. That one is number 115. It is just a bangle. Number 115. So let me just run something by you guys. So Pedro and I were talking today and we're gonna, I think we're gonna do for, is it, are we doing eight? So over the next week, probably starting next week, anybody who buys eight items or more um, will be put in a drawing for free shipping. Eight items or more. Here is Super Starstruck. Again, this is Paparazzi Brown, which I call like a yellow gold. Um, there's your earrings and there is your necklace. This is gorgeous. I love this color. 110. 110. So that's kind of what we were discussing today. So we're trying to do some some more things to kind of um, give you guys a way to, to get free shipping for those of you who order a good amount. So here's Colorful Charming. This is a red necklace. Um... Hold on here. Sorry, guys. And I like to try to have it where it shows you what it's supposed to look like. Okay. Here's this one. Silver necklace. Hello, Jared. Um, the beads with the red, with the red um, rhinds, or, um, what are these? Red beads? I can't even think of my words here. With the, they start with real small balls right there the real small little beads and then they go to the bigger silver beads again this one is 85 if you like this one 85 okay, okay. then we have an urban ring it looks like so Looks like this. Again, they also have a stretchy back, but their back is different than ours. They, they're like this, if that makes any sense to you guys. But anybody who's worn a paparazzi ring knows what ours look like. And the guys are like flush around the back versus ours. But this one, is number 66 if you like this one where am I at? here okay 66 
Okay, here we go with some blue. Love this necklace. Blue. Here is number 26. We've got the blue, the stone. So you've got the blue beads, and then you've got the blue pearl likes, silver pearl likes, silver facets in between. This one is blue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Vera, you actually bought the peach one last week. This one is the blue. I have two of these. This is actually one of my favorites. I have this one. Um, the black one's coming up next too. So, so here's what the blue looks like. That one is number 26. And let me show you the, oh, the black one I actually have a bracelet to as well. I didn't know that. I don't know why I don't have a bracelet to the, so here's the black set. Here's the black one. Let me show it to you on here. There's that. And give me a second. Let me grab the, the bracelet that goes to this one. My stand was not connected together. Okay. And this one, um, the bracelet for this one is a stretchy bracelet. So it is stretchy, but it goes. To this one so if you want the set you can comment 102 set otherwise comment 102 for the necklace and 89 for the bracelet and number 26 the blue one I only have the necklace I do not and I have two of those but I don't have a bracelet to match that one I don't know why I always I'm a set person, so I always have sets, but I definitely didn't have one. Okay, let's do a question. Ready, ready for the questions. Name something kids are told to take turns using. Name something that kids are told to take turns using. I'm glad you love it, Vera. I was wondering if you got it yet. So everybody should have got their stuff already from last from the last one. Okay, so here's the next one. This is very, very pretty, very elegant. So it's got the tan and the black. Tan and black. With the studded frames. Very nice, very nice. That one is 121. Lisa. Huh? Lisa got it. Right? Lisa got it? Good job, Lisa. All right, Michelle, you're off your game, girlfriend. Oh, is she? No, oh, I didn't know that. No wonder I haven't heard her. <laughs> All right. The next one is number 83. 83. And you've got the silver with the green. I didn't see Alexis on either. Silver with the green. It's a short necklace. Um, there we go. That one is 83. Um, right the next two I have are the same just different colors so here is the first one it is all crooked one on there so it should look like so here's your purple earrings hold on huh is that the one Alexa has? yep it's the one Alexis has and Vera Vera has That's the same blue. one so I have it in purple and I have it in pink. Purple and pink. So 111 purple or 111 pink. Lisa wants 59. Um, here, 59, 59. Hold on, let me see what 59 was. 
57, 55, 94. What was 59, Lisa? Oh, 59. The pink stretchy bracelets. These, love? Here. Okay, again, sorry guys. Um, 14, uh, 111 purple or 111 pink? Yes, you do have it in blue and your sister has it in purple? Yeah. And um, Alexis has it in purple. I love this one. This one's super cute. It's really fun. Super fun. Got them for you, Lisa. All right. Here's the next one. This one has also a matching bracelet. Give me one second here. Okay. So here's the necklace for this one. It is black on a, um, it's got crystally like a smoky gray, black looking. It just depends on the way the light hits it. Crystals, they're pressed into a silver frame on a silver necklace. Your earrings are the same color crystal. And I'm going to show you the, the bracelet that goes to it. Here is the bracelet that goes to this. Also matches the same. Very, very pretty necklace. Very pretty, I love this one. So 129 for the necklace, 128 for the bracelet, or just say 129 set, and I'll know that what it is. So let's get that back. Okay, all right, next question. Uh, tell me something people have a hard time closing. Tell me something people have a hard time closing. You got it? <laughs> huh? <laughs> okay. Next ones are some earrings. They're really, really cute. So I have them in bra or copper, sorry, copper and silver. Um, here is the copper pair. <laughs> That's cute, man. Uh, I mean, for a man, yeah, I can, I can understand that. So here's your copper ones. Let me see if I can get a little closer. You could see the, here's what they look like on the back side. Okay. Those are 112. C, upside down, good job, Sheree. And then here's 112 silver. They're kind of pressed. There we go. There. And those are the silver ones. So we have the copper and the silver. So 112 silver or 112 copper? 112, 112. Okay. What time is it then? 8.31. Hmm? 8.31. Nobody got it yet? <laughs> Alright, how many are on? Like four or five people? Uh, four. Okay, well, then everybody else can guess again. Name something people have. Hi, Miss Corey. I don't see them. I see them. Um, they, it says they wave. So... That's why I see them. Okay, so number 87 are these shiny copper hoop earrings. They're wired. If you can see them, they're wired like so. Pretty awesome. They look like this. Vera said something is wrong. <laughs> Again, these are called live wire hoops, number 87. Um, a 
I've got like three things in here. Mm -hmm. um, and then I'll go, I guess, go through everything. Okay, next, urban. Bag of chi <laughs> chip bag. <laughs> Back door. No. You guys are really going to hate it when you find out what the answer is, I hate to tell you. So this one is, again, leather and rope with your the black beads. It is a pull string to close. Christy got it. Christy got it? Yeah. Good job, Chris. <laughs> Good job. All right. This is a very interesting one, I hate to tell you guys, but... This one is called Modern Muse. It is a knuckle ring. It is brass, brass bars. It has a teardrop in the center with their, again, brown, but yellowish um, beads. <laughs> You're joking. <laughs> that one is number 11. <laughs> number 11. I think something happened with Vera's stuff. Mm. The next one is stretchy beads. Stretchy bracelets, but stretchy beads. So they are the cream color. Of course, paparazzi brown is what they call them with the two single layers of silver beads with the big um, circle pieces inside in between each yellow bead. And those are stretchy bracelet. There's three of them in this set. Okay, so let me ask everybody something. Is there, would you like me to go through everything once again? So, in case you missed it, um, is there something you want to see or just trying to get an idea? So, if you guys can throw me a comment, let me know what you think. I can go through everything. I'm going to do another question here. And then I can go through the, the board because if you guys can see the board real quick. There's a good, quite a few stuff on there. So, that way you guys, I can kind of go through it pretty quickly. Um, but let's do um, another question real quick. Name something in your house with four legs. Name something in your house or in, yeah, in your house, I would say in a house, but in your house with four legs. Need the number one answer. Um, I guess. Yeah, I wasn't on the other day, was she? So Vera, I don't know if you like these or not, babe, but I got a whole bunch of these and you weren't here last week. Um, and Lisa, you too, babe. Um, hold on, I'm trying to make sure I can get them together. Bearded dragon? Uh-huh. Who's the dad? Sister. Oh my God, Christy Lynn. Seriously. Okay, so I got these last week and I did show them, but I don't think either one of you ladies were here. So this is number 159 silver. So it's a band, they're leather. They have two strap or two snaps. Um, let me show you what it looks like. Hold on here, I gotta try to get this thing. I don't do very well with trying to put stuff on myself. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Very nice. Here is, I have this in black, red, silver, and, um, hold on, oh God. Okay, here's the red one. Hello, Miss Angie. Here's the red one, the silver one. Um, hold on, I have a brown one. I'm trying to stick them all on so see y'all can see. This one is a thin one. So my brown one is a thin. So the brown one is a thin with three separate compartments. 
These two are full, one whole piece. This one is a red backing. This one is a gray backing. I have this also in black. And then this one is a tan, if you can see. And it's it's got the three different. Christy got it. Christy Lynn, you just, you just guessed it right, baby. All right. So, I have probably three or four of each one of these colors. Oh, Vera's back. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, again, Vera, I was talking to you and I didn't even know you were gone. But I got these because I know you have girls. Um, these are really cute bracelet bands. They're leather. Um, I have them thick like this. Or I have them kind of like this, but it makes, it snaps. Mm -hmm. Amanda said she thought she was first. <laughs> Pedro's gonna check to make sure who was first, cause there's a lag. Just so you guys know, there's always a lag. Oh yeah, that's it, she was. Oh, was she? It just popped up. So he just got it and Christy, Amanda was first. So sorry about that. His stuff is not coming in like it normally has. So you guys had problems seeing me earlier, and now he's having problems seeing the things catch up. But usually there is a lag, so even if you think you said something first, it doesn't always, unfortunately, mean that's the case. But again, so I have these. I have them. I have three or four of each one of them. I have them in red, silver, black, the tan. And then I have this one, just in case I don't really know. Um, if you guys like this kind of thing, but so I have this real long one. You can either double roll it You can double roll it. I have people that use them as chokers Which are absolutely cute to be quite honest. I'm not a choker person, but so you can wear them as a choker I know a lot of teenagers that actually do that right now um, And it has three snaps on the big thick the thin long one so like I said you can double roll it for a bracelet you can use it as a choker you can um, I don't know <laughs> I'm sure there's other things you can do with it but so um, I do have quite a few of those um, so comment 159 silver 159 red 159 black I think this one is a different 156 for the tan one the the one with the three different um, layers on it. So, okay, hold on here. One fifty nine. One fifty nine. Yeah, I'm huh? Yeah, it's just lagging on my side. Yours is lagging on your side now. That's never good. Yeah, well, that's a good one. All right. So that's that. Um, what do I have? Hold on, guys. So. I did on my box, but I have a few other things that I can snatch up here. So, here is this one here. It has a what is this? Hold on. suede rope with this pendant on the bottom. So it's suede, black rope with the pendant and the little earrings that match. I have two of these. This is number 147. Um, this one. Oh, I, um, can you pull that out of the back corner, please? Because that one I sold and I never took another one out. Mm -hmm. Then you've got this rope, brown rope with wooden green beads. They're all woven on there. So actually, I can actually put it around my head. So it will sit about right here on you. You can see that. And they have little um, green wooden discs for earrings. That is 160. Cool. Put the earring back on. That's all right. You're fine. Um, go ahead and if you want to do that for me. Oh, crap. I can't do that one either. Okay, so here's another one. This is a white boho necklace. 
Hold on, why is this? Why are my necklaces all twisted? Hold on, babe. Um, it's kind of stuck. Okay, the white boho looks like this. Let me put this thing on off. Okay, so looks like so. This is white and silver. White and silver. I also have it in gold and with black. So let me see if you can see it. I just don't want to make all this crinkly noise, but I have it in black and gold as well. If you guys like the black and gold or the white and silver, that is 150 white or 150 gold. So whichever, just let me know. You can comment with that. Okay. All right, here we are. Here is, this is copper. This one is copper. Long copper with this pendant at the bottom. Copper pendant. I can't see anybody's comments at all, so I don't know what's going on. That's right, I don't need that. If you like that copper one, that's 143. Huh? 143. All right. Here is another copper. This is a longer necklace. So it looks like so. It's copper with like peach colored beads. Shows. <laughs> no, I'm just oh, trying I'm trying to see if they can. Yeah, I'm like, I'm lost. Like, I can't hear anybody or see anybody. So, I don't know what's going on on my end. Um, if you like that, that's number 146. Again, 146. Okay, so I proposed a question earlier, guys. If if you guys, hold on, I've got too much stuff behind me. I can't do. Um, do you guys want to see the board again, so you can see everything I've called? I'm going to do another card too, another um, question. But I want to see um, the people who have been kind of been off and on, off and on. Um, do you guys want me to go through the board again to let you guys know or see what you've missed? Just let us know. I'm going to read this question. If you could change anything about your job, what would it be? If you could change anything about your job, what would it be? Um, also, um, I still have sets in the back here, if you guys can see them. If you want to see any of them, please let me know, up close that is. Um, those are the sets that I have, I've put together myself, so if you want to see any of those, please let me know. And also let me know if we want to go back over the board. Um, I'm not pulling anything else, so I have two more questions. Oh, guys, sorry about this, but I'm getting hot. <laughs> so, more pay time. Lag, just now getting answered to the Sorry about that, guys. It's getting pretty hot and I uh, needed a drink. Okay. If you could change anything about your job, what would it be? I'm getting a lag in circle. Maybe that's why nobody's. I see Lisa. Mm -hmm. Was she answered? Mm hmm. She oh. put more paid time off. So I'm not getting any. So is everybody getting my question? 
Hi, BK. Hi, darling. That's all right. As long as they come out and say hi, then I know. <laughs> Change people you work with, work inside. Um, COVID. <laughs> um, Lisa said more paid time off. Nope. Hi, BK. How are you, babe? Nope. You guys are still off. So, why we are trying to get an answer. Sorry, my hair is a hot mess, but I'm hot, guys. So, okay. So, um, why we are waiting for people to get the answer to that question. Again, the question was, if you could change anything about your job, what would it be? That's what we're working at. So, while we're doing that, and we're trying to find out who's going to get that answer, I'm going to briefly go through what I have again. Here was number 75, orange and silver, fish, fish hooks. They will be about right here. Then I have number three, which is a cuff. It is purple with a smoky gray stone. That one is number three. Number 69 is a men's, our urban collection, silver. Nope, nobody's got it yet. Silver bracelet. Hello, Rachel, how are you, beautiful? Um, number 65 is another urban bracelet, um, pieces intertwined. It is a pull string, so you just pull it, and that's how it closes. That one was 65. Excuse me. Number 47 is this beautiful blue ring with the white um, stones on the side, all the way down each side. It has a thick band. It does fit sizes 6 through 10. Very good. That's 47. Then I have number 91, which is a silver filigree with three lavender stones in the center. Thick band. Again, all our rings are stretchy. Yeah. All, of our, um, all of our jewelry is nickel and lead free. And each piece is $5. Number 57. Those. Number 57. And number 15 were the red pressed beads in the silver teardrop with the filigree. Again, fish hook. Number 15. Number 58 is the pink and the silver. Pink and silver. Number 58. Number 70 from our Urban Collection. Pull string again. All leather. Father's Day is just around the corners, ladies. Just around the corner. Number 55. Silver chain with this lime green stone and tassels. Number 55. Number 94 are the silver bangles. Silver bangles. Number 94. Number 74, silver chain. Hold on here. There we go. With the orange press bead in a silver teardrop shape. Number 74. Number 116. Silver stretchy 116. Number two is a hematite stone. Very large, large hematite stone with some smaller stones on the sides. 
in a very thin band. Alexis, you just jumped on and I'm going through everything I just went through right now. Again, the hematite, that's number two. Number 92 was this black onyx with the white um, crystals, which one of my friends said that it looks like Mickey Mouse. I feel like like this. <laughs> I thought that was pretty cute. I never even noticed that. 92. 36. 36. Very, very beautiful detail. They're light. And they are about this, uh, right there. Lightweight fish hook, 36. Number 72. Hold on. 72. 72. All right, here we go again with this one. So, silver necklace comes down in a V right here where this one will actually intertwine with that one. Like, maybe it'll work for me or not. Okay. So, that's how it's actually supposed to look. It's supposed to hang inside the other one. There. There you go, orange and silver. That's 72. Number 61, yellow and silver earrings. If I can get them to hold still for you guys, there you go. Number 61. Number 60. Number 95. Can I have that bracelet back again? Number 95 looks like this. Where's my... Or like so. And here's a bracelet that matches. For those of you who like your matching stuff. Oh, there you go. Thank you. This one again is 95 and 96 is the bracelet. So 95, if you want the set, just say 95 set. If you just want the necklace, say 95 and the bracelet is 96. Where did I leave? Okay. Number 12 is brass. Brass necklace. Um, it goes this way. It is a, a little bit longer necklace, just so you guys can see. I'm gonna guess it would hang right there. So that is 12. Then we've got 81. It is light blue. Light blue. And I don't know why they always want to be difficult to work with me. It seems like this necklace is very prone to that. Hold on. Okay. So just to get an idea anyway, um, I think it's, they're all switched around. Okay. Nope, this way. Nope. It does go that way. Okay. There we go. Finally. And that's how the blue looks. That's how your blue looks. Light blue. That one's 81. Then I have 112. Crackle stone, white with brown crackle, white with brown crackle. That one is 122. Then 106, brass with filigree. Very lightweight, fish hook earrings, 106, then I have a yellow set, that's silver, looks like this, hold on, let's see, nope, oh there, wait, there's the yellow, 
That one's 80. 110 is brass. Looks like this. Oh, let's see. There's not the earring there. Brass, 110. This one is 100. I said 110. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. These are 114. They're silver with the paparazzi brown, which I call more like golden yellow, I guess. They look like this. They are fish hook. They are very lightweight. Those are 114. Stretchy beads, more for, like I've said, grandkids or teenagers of some sort. Come on here. They look like this. So you have this one side has says love and a heart. And then this side has a heart on it as well. These are stretchy. That's 49. Then I have brass bracelet with the light yellow golden stones again on either side. And then riveted rivets on the sides. Both sides. And that's a bangle. And then I have the silver and red. It's a short necklace. Silver and red. They sit inside of each other. That's 85. The man's ring. This one is 66. And I have the teal. Teal and silver. Teal and silver. That's 126. Then I have black and silver. Black and silver. Uh, oh. Can you get that? Because mm -hmm. I just dropped the bracelet. Here, you, you can. Okay, hold on for one second. I have to grab the bracelet I just threw across the floor. Sorry about that, guys. Here is the bracelet that goes to that. So 102 for the necklace, 102 set, or 102 and 89. 102 and 89. Oh, goodness. All right. 121 is black and tan. Oh, hold on here. Black and tan. That one's black and tan. It's 121. And it's awful quiet out there. Here is silver and green. Silver and green. Number 83. Then I've got purple and silver. Purple and silver. And I have it also in pink. So 111 pink or 111 purple. Then I have this smoky gray. Come on here. Smoky gray, which is 129. Um, hold on here, because this is not how it's supposed to look. Okay, here's your necklace. There's a lot of glare on that. Hold on. Okay. So, babe, can you do something with that light a little bit, please? Turn it down, turn it up, move it to the side or something. There, that's better. Okay. So, there's that one. That's 129. And here is 128, which is the matching bracelet for that one. 
Again, everything is $5 each and all nickel and lead free, plus your shipping and tax. All right, then I have silver, silver, lightweight, I sit about right here, and also copper. So 112 silver or 112 copper. Okay, now I have a shiny sil um, copper. They are wire. They will sit about right here. Very shiny. Those are post. And another urban bracelet tie. Full ties. Hello, Tiffany. That one is 71. Okay, I can sit down there. Oh, there's smokes. Okay. Next one. Is this copper? Oh, this one's brass. I'm sorry. Brass, brass. Hey, girl. How you go? How you doing? That one is number eleven. Yeah. Then I have some more stretchies. Stretchy, stretchy. Silver beads. Brown beads with the silver in between. Again, stretchies. Then I have. The leather wraps that look like this. I have these in silver, gray, no, black, silver, and red. They look like so. They're two adjustable buttons. That one. And here's the silver one. I have a black one as well. Looks like that. These are pretty actually these are pretty awesome bracelets actually. I wear them a lot. Um, so here's what it looks like on. Those are 159 red, 159 silver, 159 black. And next I have a black suede with a silver pendant. Black suede, silver pendant. That one is 147. Brown rope with wooden green beads. Brown rope with wooden green beads. That's 160. 150 is the boho. Looks like this. Looks like this. I also have this in black and or gold and black as well. So black is the is the tassel color, and then um, gold is the actual frame. Then I have this brass longer necklace with this pendant at the bottom 143 here's a, another wrap except this one is has three different strips and this is a single it's a, a single wide instead of a double wide it does have two adjustable straps as well and that one is 156 and Number 146 is brass with beads and brass balls. All right, guys. So that's where I'm at. 
I'm going to ask another question real quick, and then you guys can let us know if there's anything you guys see you want, you want to see again, um, and we will go from there. Name the worst, name the worst thing about driving behind a bus. Name the worst thing about driving behind a bus. What did he say? Oh, oh, he was talking to Kyla. So, question again. Name the worst thing about driving behind a bus. I need the number one answer. Mm -hmm. I know, I see it. Nope. 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 Anybody else? The worst thing about driving behind a bus. Nope. Neither one of those yet, girls. Anybody else? You want to see it? Mm -hmm. um, what is this one? This is the game. Okay. Hi, Miss Deborah. Um, who just got it? Amanda! Good job! Good job! All right. Amanda. Amanda was the winner of that question. Amanda move. And so does anybody else have questions about anything? Um, wants to see anything else? Um, wants to see something I've already shown? Let me know. Um, otherwise, I'm going to draw for the game. Then I'm going to draw for everybody being here and sharing and that. Any questions? Let me know. Babe, you want to do these? Hold on. Hold on. This one is for the game. Can I look at the set with the black? Uh, uh. Uh, this one, Amanda. Hold on. Give me one second, baby girl. This one. that's the one you're talking about just let me know okay so he drew a name for the game so let's see it is Amanda Amanda Moo it's you baby do you want 128 is it better for shipping to wait till I have four items to ship at a time um you want to send Lisa a message and talk to her about that um, Pedro's going to send you a message, Lisa, so you know. Um, Amanda, you won the game. So, I'm going to stick that. Let me know, um, did you say that you wanted that set, baby? The black one? This set? If so, say yes. Let me know so I can stick that in your stuff. Does anybody else have anything they would like to see or re-see that I've already shown? Um, if you guys need, have anything, please let me know. This is the drawing for people who shared and who have been present. This person here must be here to win. The game was, you didn't have to be here through the whole thing. If you didn't show up, you didn't show up, you still win. But the door prize, you have to be present to win. So... Can you do me a favor and grab this real mm -hmm. quick? Oh, dang, I'm throwing them out. Hold on. Amanda said she wants those. Okay. Okay, thank you. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. Giselle. 
Mr. Cell, if you're here, please let me know. Here, put these in Amanda's. Let's go to Amanda. Is Miss Giselle here? I'm gonna give you a minute or so to, to jump on or, or, or to send me a message and let me know if you're here. If not, I need to draw another person. Could I see the first team? Are you talking about these, Vera? And the only the other red necklace that I these do you want those okay here these are for Vera um, we need to pick another name because Miss Giselle I do not see answering and okay we put them in your stuff baby here can you grab another name Thank you. Golly, these things are little. <laughs> Becky Griffin. Becky Griffin, are you here? I think she is not here, babe. I'll give you a second. Miss Becky, could you please say if you're here or not? Man, you pick terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, babe. Yep. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's do this again. Forget about it. Get out of here. I'm <laughs> picking now because you always pick people that are gone. Oh, gosh. Aaron's gone, too. I don't think Aaron's on right now. No, he doesn't, Amanda said. <laughs> All right, so that's another one gone. All right, here, try again, babe. Come on. There's a lot of names in this box. And we just are not picking out good ones. <laughs> All right, try again. Ready? Heather Tidwell. I don't think she's here either. Nope. She is not. Sorry. I just, I pulled up all the viewers that are on there this minute. Okay, go ahead. Try again. <laughs> oh, you got two? Okay. <laughs> Ashley Jenkins is not here. Nope. Well, that still means there's a chance, ladies. <laughs> Good Lord. All right. You got it. You got this. You got it. You got a winner right there. No. I do not believe. Hold on. I'm trying to get it open here because the sticky paper is stuck together. Lisa Alley. Lisa <laughs> Alley. Nope. She is not here. Okay. Try again. Boy. I see you're here, Karen. Uh-oh, I think she's here. It's Miss Vera Padilla. I think she's here. If you're here, Miss Vera, say I'm here. Man, one, two, three, four, five, six names before we got one. Mm -hmm. Well, she's not answering yet, so. I know, she's sleeping. Vera, I hope you ain't sleeping because I'm only giving you a minute. <laughs> All right. Wow, that was crazy. Six names to get to somebody who was here. Hi, Michelle. All right, so that's... Huh? Uh, Amanda's, I stuck on her tag. All right, ladies. Um, just so you guys know, if there's something that you've seen tonight that you're thinking about, um, if you want to drop me a line, let me know. Um, I can take a picture of it for you, send it to you. And um, um, just contact me. We'll figure it out. Um, and if there's something that you are looking for and you think I may have, feel free to contact me. You never know. I might have it. Um, but I appreciate all of you guys for coming out tonight and hanging with me. It's been fun. I really like the family feed thing. I think I might try to do Trivial Pursuit or something next time. A little bit, a little bit harder. Aww. Anyway, all right. So everybody have a good evening. Do you have a spare one that looks like? Yes, I do, Amanda. Yes, the Mickey Mouse one. 
She said mm -hmm. it's lunchtime. Yeah. This one right here, baby girl. It's in your bag. Go eat your lunch. Mm -hmm. People from Australia, what can I say? Sorry, guys. <laughs> All right, everybody else, have a good evening. And I appreciate you, and I hope to see you guys on Wednesday. Unfortunately, my new box doesn't come in until Monday, so be sure to be here on Monday night because I have a huge box coming that will be here Thursday afternoon. So, I appreciate you all. Thank you so much. Um, if you are new shopping with me, please go to my website that's pinned up the bottom of the description um, and fill out the customer information so that I can invoice you. Good night, Mo. Um, and I will get this stuff shipped out as soon as I get confirmed payment. You guys have a great evening. Love you all. Bye.